Hey guys, this is Sharon. I wanted to do a quick flip through. I always have such trouble saying that. I thought that I would flip through my pages for September, now that we are in October. And I am also in the process of moving out of my Ochre Malden personal size and into my personal um, Metropole. And I'm not going to lie, it's really stressing me out <laughs> because the Malden is, I mean, they're both personal size, but the Malden is just so squishy. And at first glance, I thought the Metropole had the same type of pockets, and it does sort of in a way, but they are not nearly as flexible as these pockets are, and I'm having trouble... I'm just having trouble dealing with it, but I'm going to give it some time. Anyway, for this video, we're going to focus on September. And this is my September um, two-page monthly spread. And um, as you know, this is where I do my pre-planning um, for the month. Write down birthdays, anniversaries, appointments, where the days that we have the girls. Um, this month, I also tried uh, color coding. Let's see, we have blue is for the girls, yellow is John, pink is for work, orange is for sports, and green is for birthday, anniversary, and holidays. And that just kind of gives me a really good overview or gives me an idea at a glance of what I did for the month. So, And I'm also um, trying that for October as well. But anyway, let's get started on the pages. This is my summary. You can see, or the summary of the month. You can see that there really wasn't that much going on, although it felt like there was, but it was just the normal everyday stuff. Nothing really spectacular. But I'm using the um, Day Runner Day on Two Pages. And it looks like my battery's going to be running out, so I need to do this quickly. So again, this is where I put my tasks, personal tasks, appointments, and work tasks. And here you can see that I highlighted uh, in yellow because it was a busy day and I needed to be able to focus on certain things, so I just highlighted them to let me know that. And I think the highlighting here is just stuff that I actually finished. Yeah. So I've moved into... Um, you can see I didn't do much this day, or this day. I've been having trouble with my allergies this month, and um, they actually went into a sinus infection again. And I usually get a sinus effect infection every um, fall and every spring, so... But... <clears throat> so you can see this is where I... I'm starting to not feel so hot in the middle of the month. So my personal productivity seemed to uh, not be so hot. And again, I am just using a Pilot G2.38 gel pen. That's my favorite. Yeah, and this is just a note where I'm really starting to have a headache all the time, and it's it was really starting to bother me. That was my sinuses. This is just a little sheet um, for my weekly planning, just to um, help me focus on that a little bit. I got some fall stickers. Oh, this is Autumn Begins, so I gave it a little metallic puffy leaf sticker. And we're getting close to the end of the month, and I switched over to my orange highlighter to uh, mark completed tasks. And time for fall. This is a um, pumpkin post-it note that I got um, from, um, I can't remember her name, but um, I ordered it actually. And this is also where John left to go to the UK. You all saw that I posted in... Um, Facebook group that he went and that's how I got my Metropole. That's what he brought me back. This is a card for Bath and Body Works. 
I love the leaves and this is also a reminder that I have coupons in the back. I used these coupons and now I have coupons to use before November 2nd. So I'll probably take this and move it probably to the next Saturday that I'll be able to go to Bath and Body Works. That's usually when I go. And we're getting close to the end of the month. And we're at the end of the month. And that is it. And I'll just, I gave you a glance of October. And um, yeah, these pages aren't very filled in because I've now moved into, uh, I've moved into my Metropole. And I am going to finish that up and I will do a video on my setup and uh, let you know how that goes. I hope you guys are doing well and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.